بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله على سيدنا محمد وعلى آله وأصحابه أجمعين ورضي الله عن خلفائه الراشدين الأئمة المهديين أبي بكر وعمر وعثمان وعلي ومن اتبعهم بإحسان إلى يوم الدين أما بعد السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته dear viewers may have come to attention that the group of Shias new kids on the block have been running their mouths challenging Sunnis uh, Speaker's Corner Hyde Park London they came unannounced I repeat unannounced unannounced on a Sunday they came to Speaker's Corner in London yet yet the irony is that you see the same people approaching youngsters little kids little kids, kids. and they, little kids. they'll target them and they'll pick bully on them kids. laugh at them but oh hold on we don't debate i, think, I think i think that principle when it comes down to it is basically based on we don't debate Shias. educated cheers educate learn cheers i think we should change the principle the principle is not al-bidda the principle is we don't debate anyone who knows his stuff true Basically, yeah, if you know your stuff, no, you no, know no, your no, stuff. no, 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 you're Al-Bidda, you're Al-Bidda. The minute you're, 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 you're a layman and you're a jahil, oh, brother, you know, you do shirk and you're this, and the guys are all blank in that, and the guys are like, oh, takbir, takbir. <laughs> so basically, it's uh, the principle is wrong. Let's rename the principle. We don't debate learned learn people. Shias, yeah. We learn, the, we debate the jahil. jahil. So now we have come and no one wanted it. No one wanted to come and debate us. And that's just the reality of it. I just came to give them, to teach them a lesson. But no one wanted to debate. That's just the well, truth. Well, you sound like the North Korean regime. It claims to their own people that the whole world is afraid of you. The reality is that those Sunnis, like myself, those Muslims, Ahsan al Jama'ah, were interested to debate these people, were not informed, had no clue. And those Sunnis who were present in the park politely refused, uh, politely. Um, or rejected the offer to debate. And they were honest people who said, this is not our field, I have not much knowledge. And others followed certain principles that, well, if they have no knowledge, they don't debate. Or they don't, don't debate a little bit. After this childish public stunt, 30 plus men, well, they get, I guess they don't dare to come there except with 30 plus men, maybe next time 50 plus men. And they dream about calling it now Rafa the Corner. Never have been Rafferty Corner, never will be Rafferty Corner. Because even your own, the most knowledgeable person among you says that he came just for one day and never gonna come back. You know what I'm talking about. So, anyway, they are running their mouths now. Speaker's Corner is known, there's not many people who are experts on Shiism. And now they're claiming victory all over the net. I myself told them and I messaged their group on Facebook that I'm ready to debate you. I'm ready to debate you. Now I'm making this video message for them. I'm ready to debate them, but what happened, their brothers and sisters and their viewers, if I sent them a message early this morning, in fact it was after midnight, looking for any excuse not to debate me. You know the lies about the, my association with some Khariji devil that I explained that I have nothing to do with him and other excuses, pathetic excuses. I mean, these people went to the park. These people went to the park and were ready to bait anyone. And they're asking, I don't know, bring your shoe. Who are these people to ask for shoe? I mean, I challenge and I ask you to debate Shubayri, the Mu'amma, the one with the black turban, who did really bad at the first debate with uh, Muhammad Hijab. Muhammad Hijab, who I have prepared him in the morning before the debate. <laughs> I've pre prepared him at breakfast. At breakfast, imagine. And he still, mashallah, did very well for somebody who does not feel that at all. And we challenged this Sayyid Hamid who had one debate with Muhammad. He also said no. We asked for Shubari, as I said. And we asked for Hassan Qadri. He said he doesn't know, you have to ask his teachers. Now, I stretch my hand out to Bayad Ghadirti. And uh, I mean, this road runner, um, sorry, Blake runner, he's a kid. Neither knows Arabic, no Persian, no, I mean, Khilafat, Imamat, you know, Turmanfur, a miskin, rather. He's a miskin. Everybody does mistakes, but this is like Musiba, yeah. This is Musiba. He has a Ustad, a Sheikh Sayyid, the Sayyid Ali. 
I was informed that he's not even really uh, allowed to talk to Sunnis. There was an incident where he uh, asked the Sayyid Ali, who was the owner of uh, re or revisit re revisiting the Salaf former website that is now gone. <laughs> we bought the domain <laughs> and uh, troubleshare.net. And they have now a group on um, Facebook. And I did it at Hyde, Speaker's Corner Hyde Park. I was told that uh, this uh, road, Shia Road and Blade Runner was told, uh, I asked, asked, they said, I, can, I, can I talk to the Sunni, to the Bakri? So, hey, we have another start, another Shaykh. Why is he not coming to debate me? Stop the excuses. You know me very well. I was informed about a phone call between uh, Brother Abu Ismail. Allah and your ustad, another ustad, somebody you look up, Hassan al Qadri, and he admitted, he said, uh, he said, Wallahi al Azim, this is what I was told. He said, I know Hassan Shibrani has knowledge. You, you guys know who I am. You know what I do. Don't give me that you are not known. We do this for the sake of Islam. Fi sabilillah. We are not enemies of all Shias. Most of my family are still Shia. Although, alhamdulillah, all my brothers converted, and many people in Iran converted to Al-Sunnah wal to Islam. We just want to show the truth. We want to show that you shouting there, Wallahi, Haq Ali ibn Abi Talib. You will never forget the Haq of Ali ibn Abi Talib. Wallahi, Ali ibn Abi Talib, radiyallahu anhu wa salamu, salamullah alayhi, bari'un minkum, wa min shirkikum, wa min khurafatikum. He is free and innocent of you, and your khurafat, and your shirkiyat. And all the lies that your sect has attributed to him. That's what we say. And we, the likes of myself, I believe, inshallah, alhamdulillah, can answer all your shubuhat that are recycled shubuhat that we have studied decades ago in the language of your hausa, which is not Arabic, Persian, and in Arabic, and in English. So, any of you from Bay'at uh, al Ghadir or Bay'at e Ghadir, huh? In the language of the Hawza. No more leg, no more tails between the legs. Huh? Man up. This Sunday, inshallah, ta'ala, I'm going to be at speaker's corner. Bring any mu'ammim, any of you. Ten of you against me. Bring me your best mu'ammim. And of course, bring as much as hajar and uh, hadbans as you wish. I'm going to wait for you there, inshallah, ta'ala. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.